Wholesome memes. We need more things that are wholesome in our day. I've talked about this before, but I legitimately think that even though, you know, bad things should be covered, obviously, and not only happy things, I legitimately feel like as far as the internet goes and being informed, we could actually do with much more positive content being more popular, in my humble opinion. And whether or not you disagree does not matter to me. Consume wholesome memes. Be happy, dang it. Or, or else. Look at how proud the seal is of his art. Every time I'm in the shower, my dog stares at me, worried, and he must assume I'm upset in here because he hates bath, so he thinks if he drops his toys in it that I will feel better. I mean, well, I had a dog that did this when I was little. He would take my, my little, like, I had, like, little ducks that would float, and he would take them and show my mom and come back and drop them back in the tub. It was so cute. I'm upset in here because he hates Bath, so he thinks if he drops his toys in it that I will feel better. The fact that a random couple ran into Keanu Reeves in a hotel lobby, invited him to their wedding, and he put on a suit and joined is proof he really is the one. Aw, that's so sweet and wholesome. What the heck? Also, I'm going right back to the beginning because there was a seal and it was so fast that I, I wasn't able to perceive it with my ADHD. Look at how proud the seal is of his art. <laughs> Another time for good measure. Look at how proud the seal is of his art every time. It's even better the second time. Met a really hot girl who was half Japanese and half Filipino. I think I ruined it by constantly calling her a jalapeno. Update, we got married. A jalapeno? <laughs> They're married. He married the jalapeno. Married. After a couple of slices of pizza, my three-year-old bursts into tears and says, My mouth wants more, but my tummy doesn't. <laughs> I've relatable. never related to anything more. My neighbor felt- It is poetry. He just recited poetry. Bad about me not hitting 100k, so he made me a 95k play button. Aw, that's cute. What the heck? I just spent so long prying my step-grandmother's lock- Guys, guys, wait. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm stopping right in the middle. Speaking of this, speaking of this, speaking of this, we're at- we're almost at 40k! We're 200 away from 40k, let's you go! Yippee! Anyways, anyways, <laughs> you guys are the best, just saying. I just spent so long prying my step-grandmother's locket open, and it was 100% worth- Aww, that's so cool. Look at the puppy, oh, it's got a puppy and a kitty on the inside. I got a random FaceTime call just now, answered. It was a baby, he was playing on his mother's <laughs> phone and was typing numbers and called me. Made my night, honestly. Man. Already doing prank calls right out the womb. 11 out of 10. This party has a Roomba butler, the fanciest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Look at him! Food delivery! Seen 16 years ago today, I lost my pops. I found this old picture of him and took it at the exact same spot from about 31 years ago. Aw, that's so sweet! Rest in peace. 15 year old daughter has a friend over, and suddenly my 13 year old son wants to walk around curling dumbbells. What? <laughs> This mother lost her hair while battling a brain tumor, so her son grew out his hair to make her awake. Aww, that's sweet too! I'll never forget when a boy in my high school chemistry class told me, you will never work at NASA, and laughed at me. That was the day I decided to become an Oh, She said, bet! My little girl is two, and whenever she's happy, she will just shout out, happy, and there is nothing purer in this world happy! than when she's just sitting playing with her toys or eating toast, and just yells out, happy, to let the universe know it's doing a good job. Best friend goals, women moving- Communicating joy by screaming the word happy. Sounds- sounds great. Into same Knowing retirement. what happy is at the age of two and how to express it? home after being friends for 80 years. HR oh. at my work just called Abby. me and I thought I was in trouble for something, but they had just let me know my 11 year old sister has been commenting on their Instagram every day telling them to give me a raise. Oh my gosh. While watching a movie with my boyfriend's family, I fell asleep. In the silence of the film, I passed gas so loudly it woke me up. Everyone heard oh, it. No, that not young a man horn. the fart is his own. That's when I knew he loved me. I oh. married him. <laughs> Today, we celebrate 15 years together. Man, the hero you always wanted but never deserved. Building inspector. Well, you say you've kept everything up to code, but I've been speaking with your four-year-old and he informed me. The floor is actually lava, which <laughs> I don't need to tell you is a pretty serious safety well, well, well. Violation. I keep losing my cat in the house because she looks like. 
It does really blend in. A ceramic ornament. This is Zeus. He was stolen from his home in Montana a few months ago. Last week, he was found over 2,000 miles away in West Virginia. Since many airlines banned pit bulls, a relay team of 30 volunteers drove him all the way home in time for Christmas. Heard my six-year-old slowly and painstakingly read a natural geographic book about otters to his stuffed otter because I wanted him to know about his family. Oh my god. <laughs> He's doing great. I was petting my boyfriend's dog and he said, I'm so glad you like her. And I was like, of course, how could I not like her? She's so cute. And my boyfriend was like, no, I'm talking to my dog. It would be really awkward if my dog didn't like- <laughs> True though. No, no, no. I was talking about the dog. I'm so glad my dog likes you. Otherwise we'd have to split. Thank you. My student killed a motorcyclist in an accident. It destroyed him. He dropped out of school. Severe depression. Want to know what pulled him out of it? The parents of the man he killed. They asked to meet him for dinner. He Aww. goes now once a year. Forgiveness is healing. Diana, True, that's waitress, very sweet. Pops and kids five and under eat for free. Me, discreetly nudging my six-year-old. My six-year-old. I'm a police. Oh, I'm, I'm a police! <laughs> he tried, okay? Uh, the, the, the spirit was there, you know? four-year-old grandpa just called me for the first time on face night on facetime tonight we talked for a bit and said goodbye he thought he hung up but he didn't i stayed on the line for a bit and i could hear him in the room laughing Ooh, -hoo, that was so much fun we rushed our dog to the <laughs> he had a great time emergency 24-hour vet after a day at the beach because she was acting skittish about her tail was it broken one two a.m x-ray later and the vet says she has happy tail syndrome meaning she wagged it so hard on her beach day that it was so oh my gosh i've heard of this too where they wag their tail too much or like they bonk it into objects <laughs> oh, oh my, my god three year old said good night to all being the nerfed by too much excite no and it's a real thing it's a real thing. Hold on, I'll show you. I didn't know about it until I took my cat for a checkup one time and there was a dog who had it and they had his tail like wrapped in order to protect it. And he was still wagging it and barking it into everything in the waiting room, okay? He was still like, like he needed some armor to protect himself from his own joy. Hold on. Look, just so you guys know, this is a BS. In simple terms, happy tail syndrome occurs when dogs wag their tails so vigorously it causes injuries. How do you treat a dog's happy tail? They wrap the tail up so it would, like, have armor against his own happiness. It was so. My three-year-old said goodnight to all of us tonight. And then in the dark, I hear a little voice say, Goodnight to myself. I love you. Pause. I love you too. Don't let anyone take that from you. Aw, that's sweet. Goodnight myself, see? If you have people nice talking to you when you're little, you'll talk to yourself nice. Yes. One. My mother was Talk giggling. about treating yourself the way you want to be treated. ...at this and told me to take a look at that adorable dash hound. He's sleeping. She was looking at her purse. My niece is so chaotic. <laughs> My mom loves... Look at that adorable dash hound. It's actually a purse. I'm not going to tell her. I'm just going to let her think it's a very cute dog. I'm, I'm not going to be the one to tell her going to Starbucks, but she doesn't speak English and doesn't remember her order. Three times a week, I get a phone call from a barista and I'm like, tall caramel frappuccino oh my God. and I quickly hang up like it's some sort of caffeinated drug deal. <laughs> That's so funny. Due to expected severe weather, Monday's weightlifting workout has been cancelled. Find an elderly or disabled neighbor and shovel their driveway. Don't accept any money. That's our Monday workout. Hey, that's, that's such a sweet thing. <laughs> Go help someone. Go do some physical labor that helps someone else who can't do it. Um, It'll burn calories. Dad, get out of the car it's good for with the soul. two young boys. And he yells, who can go hug mom the fastest? And all of them started running towards their house. That's the kind of future I want. Man, Did mom better be ready. She's about to get tackled. I found out through Facebook that the overnight security guard at my work knits boots and mittens for premature babies at the Edinburgh Royal Infirmary. He also posts them worldwide. I oh, that was so cute! That's adorable. Crotch shattered a wordle. So, last summer, I randomly met this 80-year-old woman on Words with Friends. We played 300-plus games together, Holy and crap. she actually ended up becoming a good friend of mine. Today, I got to go to Florida and meet her in person. I took that really bad game I've never heard of people forming a relationship over wordle. That's crazy. Of a ...wedding t-shirt design and made it more wholesome, because love is a beautiful thing. Oh, that's a cute, that's cute. I love it. Thailand started 2020 with a major plastic bag ban, so now Thais have made it a trend to put their shoppings in random things and I'm living for it. Every <laughs> Man! This is great. The amount of creativity here is untapped.
Night, before we put our or dog uncapped. in his kennel, me and my girlfriend pretend we are sentencing him to prison for a different crime. She always jails him <laughs> for crimes like being too cute or aggravated fluff, while I sentence him for things like conspiracy to commit arson or fraud. This is great. I love this idea so much. And waiting outside my apartment lease, I moved in, slept my first night in it. When I was a boy in foster care, I used to think before sleeping, someday I will have my very own house and nobody will tell me I have to leave. Now, that is true. My 19-year-old son let's bought go. a car today. The guy who sold it to him took the cash, counted 1,000 and gave it back to him, saying, good luck in college, pay it forward. Unbelievably kind and brought tears Base. to my eyes. I always Giga heard Chad. my parents talking shit about me after I went to bed. So now I always make sure that after bedtime, my daughter can hear us through the door talking about all the good things she did that day and Aww. how proud we are of her just now that's walking so down the street, sweet eating a banana i spotted a woman at a bus stop also eating a banana to her horror and mine oh, i was no. physically unable to stop myself raising my banana to her in some sort oh of my God. <laughs> one of us one of us another banana lady at the bus stop she looked very confused, then adorably bobbed her banana bag. Let's Muhammad go! Ali, float like a butterfly, done, sting like a bee. I am nailing this. Empty your mind, be formless, shapeless, like water. I could not be any more mindless or like water. <laughs> in 2012, John Unger was captured floating his dog to sleep in Lake Superior. His dog had developed severe arthritis and had Aww. weeks to live. John responded by taking him to Lake Superior every night to ease the That's pain so in sweet. his final days. A couple of days ago, my brother wanted me to kill a moth who flew into the the kitchen. I refuse to. I would like to introduce you to Reginald. He has been living in our kitchen for two days. Reginald is lovely. feed him brown sugar. The anatomy <laughs> of a hug. That's I a really cute moth. At a wildlife rehab facility, I met two crows that said Car. in a human accent. They said it like a human reading the word Car. out loud. The tech shook her head and said, they're making fun of us. People say Car. to them all day, oh. so they've started <laughs> impersonating us. Oh I my gosh. They're like, yeah, you impersonate me. Uno reverse card, how do you like it? This is how you sound, by the way. I love crows. One time, I met a small autistic child at the vet and told him I'm autistic too. Then he asked if he could pet the kitten I had with me. I said yes, and when he was done petting her, his mom told him to say thanks, and he thanked the kitten. They're talking about <laughs> Thank you, kitten, for letting me pet you. <laughs> 11 out of 10 other i'm going to melt one time i called my boyfriend dumb because he took the bus instead of the metro to work the bus takes longer and he hit me with i take the bus so i can call you every day before work i don't get signal on the metro and then i realized i am dumb and i think about that <laughs> man this whole time i thought he was doing this and, and i needed to correct him huge flex can we talk about how cute motorcycle gangs are? Inseparable friends, matching outfits, going on adventures together. What a wholesome, adorable, fun, lucky dog. <laughs> it is, it is something how they're all like usually rugged and wearing leather jackets, but they're just, they're just like, you know, people, besties hanging out together. It's like the squad pulling up, usually to get like breakfast or something. <laughs> Last With night I was other. alone in the emergency room crying and getting an IV put in. Always a challenge for me because of my veins. And my nurse gave me her and my nurse gave me her phone and told me to go through her Tinder matches and weed them oh out for her to distract me. <laughs> what did we do to deserve nurses like actually? Me and my wife both <laughs> woke hilarious. up randomly at 2 a.m. yesterday. Instead of going back to bed, we spent a few hours in the dark chatting and laughing about random shit we've been through over the years. I, I feel like you need someone like this in your life. They don't have to be a significant other, just a friend that'll talk to you in the wee hours about everything and nothing at all get you a person that is uh this fun to be around platonically or otherwise dutch supermarket introduced slow checkouts for lonely elderly people who want someone to talk to the move has proven to be successful Aww. so that they have installed over 200 checkouts they also have added a chat corner where locals could meet for a cup That's of coffee sweet. and a chat i'm on a plane and the entire flight sat still so that a man in the last seat at the back of the plane could get off and run to his next flight to try and make it to his twin daughter's first father daughter dance everyone rooted for him and clapped as he rushed down the aisle so Let's my family go! finally understands what I do now. For the very first time in my life, a tall person stood in front of me at a concert, looked back and asked, can you still see? And then answered themselves with, of course you can't. I'm like six feet tall. And then moved. Aww. I wish so many blessings on their house. Okay, this one takes it to Very me sweet too. person. Service dog receives his Did you see spirit. that? <laughs> he did it so fast. I feel like we should give this person a raise.
they're truly taking their job the most seriously. Service Dog receives his master's degree in occupational therapy from Clarkson University after attending every class with this human. I nice. played Dungeons and Dragons with my daughters. They were supposed to fight the wolves surrounding a town. Instead, they fed the wolves and turned them into a friendly wolf army. Girls, man, they will take over the- <laughs> This is the type of stuff I would do when I used to play d and I'm like, can I befriend it with enough charisma? Or- Knowledge of animal handling. World. My three-year-old was begging me to buy her something at the store, and I usually don't give in, but this time I did it because it was only 99 cents, and it was this bunch of scallions. <laughs> Out of all the things you could ask for, if this makes you happy, sure, why not? During teaching today, I was petting my cat, and my co-teacher announced it and asked to see the cat. Then no fewer than 60% of the students reached down and pulled their cats up into the view of the cameras, and suddenly my zoom squares were all cats <laughs> and everything was perfect. This is perfect! This is great! This is the best day of class! I went to Target today and was buying all of my student supplies for the upcoming school year and was pushing a cart full of massive amounts of stuff and a lady stops me and says, Are you a teacher? So I say yes and she says, I don't care the price, I will pay for it. Oh, that's that's so nice. Tool. I was unable to find childcare for my daughter this week, so we have been hanging out. Today, I took her on a 5 kilometer run slash bike ride. I try to run and she bikes. Halfway, she looked at me and said, This is the best day of my life, Dad. If anyone Aww. needs me, I am out buying a pony. I ran into a guy <laughs> I played football. Now I'm getting a pony, obviously. <laughs> With the nice. As he's introducing me to his girlfriend, he says, This is John. He was the only popular kid in high school who didn't bully me. He was actually my friend. Aww. Just a reminder that people never forget how you make them feel. That's so cute. What the heck? That's so cute. Girl. Any song is better if you replace the word girl with squirrel. Go ahead. Try it. My wife. <laughs> I don't know where to apply this, but I, I really want to, but I'll probably forget by the time I listen to a song. I felt anxious this morning. I had work to do, but encouraged her to get away. I would watch the kids. An hour later, she returned home with donuts and an iced coffee for each of us and a smile. Last Duh. night, my boyfriend got drunk and told me if I tried to kiss him, he would call his woman. And I kissed him, so he called my phone just to tell me that I tried to kiss him. I once oh. gave one of my teachers one of my very favorite toys. Hold on, I, I need to I need to let that cook for a minute. My boyfriend got drunk and told me if I tried to kiss him, he would call his woman. Never mind. It was- it was a funny joke that also was kind of stupid. I once gave one of my teachers one of my very favorite toys. Fast forward three decades. I had twins. Yesterday, I got a package in the mail. Congratulations. I honestly- I can't read that. <laughs> Dear, congratulations on your- I know this isn't murderous. This is another word. Babies. <laughs> I feel like that's not the right adjective. They are lucky to have you- for their mother. I have saved this toy for 26 years because I couldn't part, couldn't part with it. I think now is the perfect time to return it to you. You have always had precious and special memories for me. That's very sweet. I've read many things from my grandma who would write things very quickly and cursive, all right? You're welcome. Somehow I could read that. I adore my coffee guy. I always get a large Can you read doctor's handwriting too? Yes. Coffee. And at first I would walk in and he would be like, large coffee, right? But now he just does finger guns at me and goes, large. And I would be lying if I said that wasn't the best part of my day. <laughs> he knows. God, I love a good walk. Look at these trees. Hell man. Fuck man. Is that a pine cone? Hell yeah. Am I going to awkwardly nod at passing strangers? Don't mind if I do. Nothing like some fresh air. <laughs> Our friend has grown up. Swedish literally- Wait, let me see. That's the girl from the meme. <laughs> Nope. Swedish literally translated names for animals. Blubber hunter, inkfish, river horse, late walker, leech cone, beak animal, wash bear, shield toad, and flapping mouse. Honestly, that's pretty accurate. Grandma sends me these every day. She is the purest thing on and we have to protect her at all costs. I love you. From Einstein Bagels. I love you from my front room. Good afternoon, princess. Hello, beautiful <laughs> That's grand. so sweet. My parents have been married for 34 years. My mother is in the final stages of young onset dementia, diagnosed five years ago at 53. My dad cares for her full time. She does not always remember his name, but she knows she is safe with him. If that's, that's very not true sweet. Love, I don't know what is. I lost my dad four days before my seventh birthday. Tomorrow 
is my six-year-old's birthday. Mama, since you are probably really sad on your seventh birthday, you can share my birthday with me. Me, 24 years of a broken heart, healed just like that. Yep. My neighbors are too low income healed. to afford a Wi-Fi connection and too proud to use mine. So I renamed mine Free Council Wi-Fi and told free them I had read about Wi-Fi. it and what the password was. My neighbor is now halfway through an online college Let qualification go. and I'm so proud of her. My favorite thing in the world is responding to my hateful messages and seeing how fast I can change their mood. Shut the fuck up and go back wherever you came from. You look really nice in your icon. What do you use to whiten your teeth like that? I'm pretty nice usually, just a little sick right now. My girlfriend does it. I don't really prefer it. Oh my god. <laughs> Man. I've never tried this before. Now I kind of want to. Picture. I like your facial hair. Where does one get those? Any drugstore like CBS. Appreciate it. Well, <laughs> it's like you'd be surprised how much mean people, maybe sometimes, you know, just need a little bit of kindness, but I don't know. I'd be willing to try this as an experiment. Well, sorry to have been rude, I've got man. plenty of bad YouTube comments that I could try. Have a good night. Sleep well, homie. I drew her, and she drew me. Moved to Japan, and met my neighbor. I guess I should preface that with, I have like three or four times as many good ones than bad ones. I can't speak English. Thank you for the present. My name is Hiroshi Yamashita. I'm 52 years old. The divorce, and I live alone. You can use it as you like. I'm stuffed in toilet paper. Do you have navy? Yes or no? Please tell me your child's name. Thank you That's for your so friend cute. operation. I put these clocks up when my four children start traveling and living abroad, and I keep them set to the time zone where each of them are. This morning, for the oh first gosh. time in almost three years, they are all on the same time. Bro, yeah. that would be kind of scary. Like, it's... <laughs> I don't know, is something gonna happen today? Like, whoa. Yesterday, I overheard a little kid asking their mom why I was using a wheelchair, and the mom simply replied, well, maybe his legs need a bit of extra help. You can ask him if he's happy to tell you more. No shaming the kid for asking, no treating disability as a hush-hush topic. I think that's a great way to approach it, like, like, just a human thing. I love when you like, ask- Like, curiosity isn't a bad thing if you approach it kindly someone about a thing they know a lot about and they start with okay so because you know you're about to get a novel's worth of nerd shit and it's going to be so delightful <laughs> that's so true though <laughs> whenever someone does this like whenever they divulge me and their hyper like interest i'm like i'm a hold on i'll get some popcorn i'm ready one time a customer in Starbucks asked me to help him text this girl he really liked so he could ask her out. He asked if I wanted to see a photo of her, and I said yes, obviously. And he turned the phone around, and the camera was facing me. Honestly, best work I've ever seen. Wow, that is like... Woo! Talk about the best pickup move I've heard in a while. But it also really puts you on the spot. But man, that's clever. That's very clever. Scene. Does anyone else smile at dogs that walk past them, or am I just a widow? I always smile at, at dogs. Today I waited on three ten-year-old boys. They ordered three virgin pina coladas, and when I asked them if they wanted food, they told me, Nah, it's just a chips and drinks kind of day. <laughs> Understandable. And then they tipped me $11 on top of their $11 check. Let's I go! Cultured individuals! My husband, the extrovert, and I, the introvert, got separated on our flight. We are in middle seats in the same row. I've already apologized to the people sitting next to me, like, seven times. My husband is sharing beef jerky with strangers, <laughs> and I think he's now in someone's wedding. A bottle of water can be 50 cents at the supermarket, two dollars at the gym, three dollars at the movie, and six dollars on a plane. Same water. Only thing that changed its value was the place. Yep. So, next time you feel your worth is nothing, maybe you are at the wrong place. Ooh, that's a really good one. That's a really good motivational quote. You know, unless unless you want to like interpret it differently, like your price is really overvalued. You know, like you're way too expensive for just being basic water. Biquette, the goat, sold to an abattoir <laughs> after she stopped producing milk but was rescued by punks and then spent 10 years watching grindcore bands. She could come and go as she pleased and, in the words of her rescuers, he escaped death, lived punk, absolute legend. Look at those ears, man. She's got that wide stance. 
legend. Thank you for creating Planeters and Vinland Saga. Does Hild have a birthday, sir? Thank you for enjoying my manga. When is your birthday? It's November 23rd. Hild was born on November 23rd. Oh, that's awesome. That's sweet. I'm losing my mind over these Halloween decorations. I just walked past. OMG. My cat <laughs> looks like a Catholic saint portrait here. My dad once wrote a note to us and put it in a drawer. The note said, if you're scared to tell me something, just bring me this note as a reminder that I'm here to support you and I won't get mad. I will work with you on a solution. Best way to keep your kids talking. That's very sweet. I like this one too. To you. What perks did you enjoy as a kid because of your parents' jobs? My parents ran a huge computing company and they had a huge computer with a very primitive couple of games I would play. They also had a Coke machine on the honest system and I drank those all the time. <laughs> I finally ran into my mum at college and she took me to her class to meet her classmates and it was the cutest thing ever. Having a conversation with my grandma with Alzheimer's. It was nice seeing you. It was nice remembering you. You remember me. I don't remember your name, but I remember that I love you. Aww. A few weeks ago, I tried to literally bore my three-year-old to sleep by telling him everything I knew about nuclear and particle physics. It's a fair bit. It was my speciality once. Every night since then, as he's been falling asleep, his little voice pipes up, tell me about Atom's dad. Oh my god, it's like it's his nightly like story that puts him to sleep. Tell me that story about atoms and science of alternate proportions that I cannot fathom. I was Father? having a terrible day at the bookstore until two kids came in with chaotic energy and said they were having a sleepover and wanted to get two copies of the same book so they could stay up late reading together. If you were Nerds! Ever no, I'm just kidding. I didn't know kids could read! A lunch lady in a small public elementary school in East Orange NJ in the early 80s and you snuck a small shy girl with blue eyes and bangs a peanut butter sandwich on the days she had no lunch money. Know that I have loved you my entire life and I hope you've been happy and healthy. We had to work with a partner. pb and sandwiches are the best. I know that wasn't the point of that, but man, I could go for a peanut butter and jelly in math today and I got paired with this really quiet kid and I noticed he had a lot of change in his backpack and I asked him why and he told me that he works as a janitor at the school and he saves his change to put in expired parking meters on campus. Aww. I needed this so much today. That is extremely, that's a good Samaritan, man. Hi, Dublin Bus News. My three-year-old wanted to know how you decide which buses get to sleep inside the depot garage and which have to sleep in the yard. Hi, Matthew. We have rang around to a few of the depots and we can confirm that all buses are loved equally and oh. take turns <laughs> sleeping inside the warm depot. Those sleeping outside are given cocoa. Keep warm. Hi. Oh, <laughs> that's so great. I once told my husband I was jealous We only of treat our buses with the finest care finish PhD students because they got given a sword when they graduate. Sadly, what? my That's graduation great. this week has been postponed due to the virus, but he got me a sword. Let's go! <laughs> my voice cracked. I was so excited about that. Hey, everyone. I've been having trouble catching that mouse. Do you have any tips? Be patient. Don't pounce too soon. You've got this. Mice are very sneaky, but so are you. Use all of your senses. Stay positive and keep focus. Self-doubt is your worst enemy. Yesterday, True. I was 233 days sober. I had a really stressful council meeting last night. I came home craving a bourbon Manhattan in the worst way. I took some melatonin, played video games until it kicked in, and woke up today at 234. It's really hard. Incredibly oh. proud of my mom for actively creating an inclusive workplace. Good morning. It is in my pleasure to be your breakfast hostess today, and I look forward to taking awesome care of you. I do ask a very small favor. Please wave to get my attention and use the notepads provided to let me know what you need. I only ask because I am deaf, but this will not stop me from providing you with the highest level of service. That is so sweet. What the heck? Thank you so much, Amy. That was the best. That's so sweet. Very wholesome. 11 out of 10. Um. Ba-ra-ba-ra-ba-ra-ba-ra-ba-ra.